Hello everyone, my name is Song and today I will present you guys about Dick's Sporting Goods Company and how did it take over its e-commerce operations. To answer the four questions from the textbook, I have divided my talk into four sections. The first section is Dick's decision to leave eBay. The second one is the omni-channel strategy. The third one is Dick's new website development. And finally, is the benefits of the new system. But before we get started, I will give you guys a brief look on the Dick's Sporting Goods Company. It was founded in 1948 by Dick Stack and later on it was taken over by his son, Edward Stack. The company also runs two smaller franchises, which is Field and Stream and Golf Galaxy. Dick sells everything relating to sports, for example, footwear, equipment, apparel, accessory, with all the brands all over the world like Adidas or the North Face. Unlike its competitor, Dix was quick to embrace the new online channel. Dix collaborated with eBay to f for 10 years, and during that period, Dix's sales has increased by 40%. But along with the increase in the sales is the increase in the cost the company has to pay for eBay as commission. The, the cost became too high that the company decided to leave eBay. Beside the expenses that bother the company when collaborating with eBay, there is some uh, difficulty to customize the pre-made system and services. Therefore, they decided to do on its own. And there are some benefits when do, doing your own e-commerce system. First, the company can differentiate its web presence from other competitors. Second, it can adjust the software and services to be suitable for the capability. Third, is Dix can be more easily to maintain the access to the customer data. And Dick chose omni-channel strategy for its new system. Omni-channel strategy basically means that the company can get approach to the customers by all types of channel for example facebook youtube google and their own website for example i am the customer and i want to buy a pair of sneakers then the company can get approach to me through facebook when I'm surfing this Facebook, I can buy or uh, get to choose the size, the color, the design of the sneakers I want. And then I can visit their website to click buy that item. Then after getting the confirmation email from the company, I can go to the store and pick up the item I have already bought. But to make sure the omni-channel work, you have to make sure that the ordering system is unified. And to do that, uh, Dix has turned its store into a mini distribution center so that it can ship the item from or uh, to their store. At the same time, Dix turned the store into a showroom so that the customer who has already bought the item online can go to that showroom to pick up the item. Uh, but before applying the omni-channel strategy, Dick needs to develop its own website. There are three steps Dick has done to develop its new website. First, in 2014, Dick developed its new platform and integrated it with the existing systems. Second, in 2015, instead of launching its flagship Dick's Sporting Goods Company, Dick's decided to launch its two smaller franchises, which is Phil, Phil and Stream and Golf Galaxy, to make sure that 
uh, bad things won't happen, and if it does, it would be more easily to deal with it. Two years later, Dick Sporting Goods was officially launched to the new platform. The new system has bring benefits to the company. The first benefit is that the new system allows the customer to buy item online and then they can get to the physical store and pick it up. Second, the new system allows the company to ship the goods from or to their physical store. Then the the new system also help associate the ordering system so that they can apply the omni-channel strategy smoothly. Next, the new system help analyze the regional pricing and marketing approaches, which helped the company to improve their uh, mistakes. And also, the new system has improved the searching function, helping the customer to be easily assessed to their desired item and also help the company to manage the information better. But during the process of developing the new system, the company had to face some difficulties. The first is that during the process of integrating the legacy system and the new system, they have to make sure that there will be no as loss to assess the information. Second, they have to hire new employees. Third, they have to avoid implementation delays, cost overruns, outages, and other delays. And finally, they have to face many extreme, ex extremely experienced competitors like Amazon. Many competitors who has not successfully applied the new e-commerce system when bankrupted and due to such bankrupted the Dick's market share is growing bigger and bigger along with the stronger e-commerce system of Dick we can see in the data that in 2016 the whole year market share of Dix was almost 12 percent but in at the end of the year the whole market share was almost 18 percent with a total value of almost 950 million dollars many analysts think that Dick will eventually suffer the same fate at their as their competitors, but we can see that Dick is very is doing very well, even more than well, that to develop its own system, and hopefully in the future we can see more and more unique feature in Dick's system to become more and more successful in the future. So. This is the end of my presentation and I will give you a brief look back onto the whole uh, presentation. First, Dick decided to leave eBay because of the expense, too high expense. Then, to develop its own system, Dick chose the omni-channel strategy a unique with unique features like helping the customer to buy item online and then they can pick it up from the store or can get even get their item shipped into the house and then uh, there are three steps that did has done to develop its new website first they uh, develop a new function then they launch the two smaller franchise first and finally they launch the main the flagship Dick's Sporting Goods Company. Finally, there are so many benefits that 
the new system has brought to Dick's Sporting Goods Company and the most outstanding feature is that the company can help the customer to buy their goods online everywhere they go and then they can get all they have to do is go to the store and pick up the item so this is the end of my presentation thank you for listening and if you have any question please comment below and i will try my best to give you the most suitable answer goodbye